Hey guys, Sander69046 here, and I'm back with another episode of Tornado Survival Season 7, Episode 31. And he just popped out an egg. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Um, in today's episode, let me turn this back on. Sometimes I do off camera work and I turn off the storm rate because it gets annoying to have to cut back in and say, Hey guys, it's storm, or there's a tornado, so for the 12th time today. So I, uh, I turn that off during the uh, off camera work. But I leave it on during streams, so don't think that, you know, uh, during streams that I don't have that there. But, oh, speaking of storms. But in today's episode, we're going to do some cleanup work. Or not cleanup. We're going to do a couple small tasks, so it'll probably be another four hour long episode like all of them have been lately. Um, I did that live stream like I promised, and uh, because of it, I... I did a lot of work. I didn't finish up at the villages, but I did a lot of work at the villages, and I'll show that eventually. But the first thing we're going to do is I was grabbing some cactus because, I, like I said, I was doing work at the village and I needed more green glass to put in ground lights. And while I was doing that, I uh, stumbled upon a second village beyond this other village which we originally got our villagers from for the end ground village try to stick with me here on this very confusing train of thought but beyond this first village which we know of remember I took the railway through here and transported all the villagers there there's another village and apparently in this village there's a villager who trades for mending he has a mending trade and we have a lot of good items. Um, so I would like to put mending on all of these items. And maybe even a couple more. So we're just going to go here. Not this one, but one more over. <laughs> we're going to go here and we're going to grab several... Is this already spinning? Oh dear. Where do you think that's going? Hopefully not towards our uh, house. <laughs> But yeah, we're just going to head over here, get a few enchantments, and hopefully our house still exists when we get back. Oh, cool. I know, we traded this guy and he can't even jump two blocks. <laughs> oh, look, and there's a sandstorm going on over there. Um, this village might actually be in the sandstorm because there was some sand piled up. Of course, you can see the extent of which the sandstorm travels. There's the village over here. Uh, cause you can see, yeah, all the way over there. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be in the sandstorm, aren't we? Oh no. <laughs> um, where were we going? We should be stumbling upon a village here soon. It's hard to see though. Yeah, really hard to see. Oh, cool, I can look at the mini-map. We're here. <laughs> there we go. Wherever the villages, villagers are. Alright, so, for some reason, horses have been disappearing once I get off them. So that one's gonna stay. <laughs> I think he's in here. Yeah, here he is. Pretty sucky paper trade, but... Let's see, we want it for one, two, three, four, five, six... We want at least six. So let's just go ahead and... Alright. We're just going to grab all of these. We also want it for our armor. I knew that was going to happen. Surely he will... Yeah. I wonder what else he's got. Who cares? Okay, so... So sword, pick, pick, shovel, bow, axe, head, chest plate, pants, boots. And then we want one for our elytra too. <laughs> so I just spent all of our emeralds. But it was definitely worth it because this guy's got some good trades. Let's just go ahead and unlock the rest of them too if we can. Is that enough? No, he wants another one. So we're more strategic. Oh, that was good enough for him. 
Silk Touch. It's not bad. <laughs> this is a pretty good villager. I, uh, I might want to come back and get him one day. Not today, <laughs> but one day. Of course there's other villagers, too. Where are they? I don't know. Might be dead. How did sand get in here? I guess because of the roof? Well, that's kind of crazy. That doesn't make much sense to me. Alright, let's see. Is there any other villagers in here? That I should check into? Well, there are quite a few in here. Hello, are you guys good? Uh, farmer, that's... Would be helpful to have. Oh, two farmers. Okay, that's just great. <laughs> okay, but that's that's not our point here. Um, we can go ahead and head out because we got everything we need. So I'm just gonna cut out until I'm back at the base, and I'll see you guys then. All right, so we made it back to the house, and we're just gonna put this on everything. <laughs> so first one is a uh, our sword. Next one is going to be our uh, pick here, and shovel. We're not going to do it on the axe because the axe is, uh, oh no, why not? Hmm, it's interesting that it won't let me do it on the bow. We're going to have to grab that bow that's upstairs and see if it'll let me do it on that. Ooh, now that's, uh, that's a higher enchant on that. Alright, and finally the boot. Ooh, I'm out of the levels. Okay, fair enough. Let's see, so... I want to just check, because we got this bow. It's not bad. Power 4, Infinity Breaking two punch one. It needs some improvements, but it's still not a bad bow. I'm just curious. I can't. I guess you just can't put them on bows. Oh, you can't put infinity and mending on bows. Okay, that's fine. We'll just have to. Uh, we'll have to go through bow and arrows, unfortunately, or repair them. I guess. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so we need five levels so we can repair. Repair that. Let's just grab some levels, because technically this is going to go to repairing our tools, right? Let's see. Yeah, see it's repairing instead of uh, gaining experience for us. Which is gonna, it's gonna do that until we fully, uh, repair all our items. Which is why we're going to need an XP form. Which will be the segue of the second part of this episode, because we're going to be preparing to build an XP form. <laughs> if you didn't figure that out. <laughs> Alright, so it's been a bit, and, uh, off camera, I, uh, went to did some mining. And let me tell you, <laughs> the uh, mending has done wonders on my armor, because I have it on. I just now got the levels to put on my boots. And uh, yeah, I did some mining and I got levels. And I did get some diamonds and some stuff, so we're kind of restocked the way we should be. A little low on emeralds, just because, uh, as everyone knows, I traded for the mending. But we've still got quite a few books. And what I want to do now is we're going to take one of these mending books. That was weird. And we're going to take an Unbreaking 3 book. And do we have any gunpowder? Not a lot. Basically, I want to go and try and hunt down a... Uh, hunt down a... What do you call those things? I want to get the... Uh, words are escaping my mind currently. Um... I want to get the elytra wings because they're in that version. Also, I installed a texture pack. It's Ant Venom's Faithful. The reason I did that is because uh, I kind of figured I'd switch it up. Basically, it makes everything greener, also faithful, and also a custom UI, which I uh, really appreciate. That was weird. 
So, uh, oh, the sun is setting. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to the end. I'm gonna put some supplies. It also switches up to the old sound. I'm gonna, s you know, stack up on some supplies, and we're gonna head over to the end. So I'm uh, trying to find this village, and uh, or I'm trying to find the uh, stronghold. And I thought I could ride in the direction of where it might be, and I stumbled upon a village here. <laughs> and also, apparently, a uh, desert temple. <laughs> I don't think I've discovered this yet, so we might as well hop in and see what's in it. Um, I'm not that far down the road, so last time I did this, I ended up stepping on the pressure plate, so let's just, yeah, break that this time. And I guess I'm going to toss up an end pearl, because I don't know where I am going. Oh, here we go. I might as well take all of it, right? Might as well. I'll leave the sand, obviously. And I don't really want bones. Just so I can trade that rotten flesh for emeralds. So I might as well grab it. Also have chest in my inventory, so. Oh, what did this have? Nothing special. Alright. Let the quest for the stronghold continue, I guess. Alright guys, I must have really gotten lost here, because I just found another one of these that is just untouched. So, I guess we'll loot it. <laughs> um, oh. I guess we'll take these. Um, let's put down the ender chest here. Why do I have two ender chests? Hello? <laughs> let's just put all this random junk in here like so I guess we'll keep the golden apples on us uh, no we don't even want to take that with us another golden apple uh, saddle horse armor and uh, a couple of mob loot oh and these books yep and I guess I'll take the chest with me like I said Uh, I guess I'm going to have to throw everything else out once I get up to the top. Um, that's pretty much it. Look at all these bones that I don't need. And then that, yep. Alright. Let's build back up out of here, and I guess I'm going to continue looking. Oh, there's an abandoned mine shaft here, though. Don't you see that? It's interesting say the least. Alright, I gathered my things and found the portal room. And in the portal room, we're going to make another portal. <laughs> because we need to... We need to be able to fast travel between here and there. So we're going to do that and get a piece of iron. And we're going to find gravel somewhere in this place. And that unfortunately might take a while. <laughs> Huh, I guess I never opened that. Um, I don't know where to go to find gravel. <laughs> but I'm going to be on the lookout because we need gravel in order to ignite this thing. Alright, I guess I'm going to have to cut out until I can find a piece of gravel. Alright, so after a much, much, much difficult <laughs> adventure, I finally found a piece of gravel. And the difficulty wasn't finding the gravel, it was finding a way back. <laughs> it took forever to find the stupid portal room again. So let's just hop in here and see where we spawn. Doesn't appear we've been here before. Maybe we have. Because that is, uh... There's lava falling. Surely we're not that close to, uh, we're not that far away from home. I would think. I don't know, we'll have to see. It's, uh, 
can't really adventure now. Uh, let's just check out this small little part right here. Thought maybe I dug that out. Um, let's just see. Oh yeah, we've been in this area. Yeah, there's a bridge there. Yeah, we've been in around. Now, do I know the way out? Not at all. I just know we've been here. Actually, that might be it right there. So, now the distance from... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The distance from home to here is just... Let's see if you can see the portal. Right there. So it's not a bad walk at all. We'll probably make another highway to get from the original spawn portal there to the stronghold. Um, now let's see if I can remember my way back. <laughs> this might be more difficult. Now there we are. Yep, that's not bad at all. Alright, let's, uh, let's get back to what we were doing here. Oh, we're going to have to fix that. <laughs> Alright, so... Got everything, right? We should probably take that with us. Let's just jump in. <laughs> and there's all the death markers. <laughs> and I think in order for this to work... First of all, I kind of want to kill some more Endermen here. Hello? Okay. <laughs> I was like, uh, why am I... Why am I right here? It's interesting that it's only a thousand blocks away. Okay, so let's just grab everything while we're in here. You know, some coarse fruit. Doesn't this craft stuff? I thought there were seeds that came with this too. Do I have to mine the seeds themselves? Yeah. So if I plant these, these will grow a new thing. I forget what these are used for. I know you can eat them. That's a problem. Uh oh. The good news about this is I have Depth Strider. So I can maneuver this pretty easily. He'll probably just end up killing himself by the time he gets to me. <laughs> Alright, you wanna go, bud? I think I technically brought a pumpkin, didn't I? I did. Alright, let's uh... Let's go on an adventure then. I'll cut in whenever I see something interesting. Alright guys, so I've uh... I've done some searching, and there should be an oh, an end city right up over this hill. And uh, this one's actually pretty close by. I should have marked where our return point was, but that's fine, I guess. Nonetheless, we're, uh, oh, this one has a boat. That's good. I think that'll have the, uh, the one things in them, the wings, hopefully. The Elytras, as they're officially called. <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to Ender Pearl over there or not, but we'll give it our best shot. We'll definitely manufacture this. This might be my first ever end city that I've gone to. I've never played the game at this version to this point. Um, oh, and the city at the end of the game. Oh, I didn't want to take you on. Okay. Now we want to get these shells, right? Because these will have the, uh... We have the shulker boxes. We want those. Alright. These chests, yeah, they usually have some good stuff. Protection for mending, that's really good. Um... And then just a bunch of random crap here. Probably should have brought more room. Uh, what did I, what did I do here? Uh, yeah, put that back in there. 
Yeah, I probably should have brought more room, but that's fine. Uh, this will save inventory. As you can see, we've already got quite a bit of loot. Oh yeah, I was going to take the chest, wasn't I? Hey man, you got to understand that these chests have a lot of wood to use to craft them. Alright, I've reached another one of these loot rooms, and uh, we've definitely been killing shulkers. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Protection 3, 5 diamonds. Oh, efficiency 5. I mean, I'm just going to take that just in case, because that's like a... That's decent, you know? <laughs> that's a decent little outfit you got. Unbreaking 3, Depth Strider 3. Like, these are all good. Good pieces of stuff. It's a real shame that, uh... I can't get any of this into my inventory. Um, yeah, I really want to take this stuff. Just, just you know, because if I can have, you know, an extra tool set for when I die, and you know that tool sets I don't if iron tools efficiency and none breaking, that's pretty good if you ask me. Where, where did you come from? Where are you shooting me from? Oh no. Good thing I got feather falling. <laughs> there you are. You little bugger. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna cut out again until I can get some more loot. Alright guys, I think I explored all of that, so it's time to hop onto the boat here. And let's just see what we got. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. If anyone wants some instant healing, you got it. And there's my elytra. Hello, how do you do? <laughs> nice to meet you, I've been looking forward to this. Alright, let's see what we can do. Inventory wise here, um, I know I want this, this can go in the chest, I'm breaking three, I'm going to have to say goodbye to the crafting table, what are these, beetroot seeds, why, <laughs> doesn't even make sense, alright, and I know I want these too, yep, the sky's the limit everyone, alright, let's just, uh, Let's get what we need here. This is going to create some inventory space too. So we're going to take these and we're going to add mending. We're going to add on breaking three. And we are able to fly. Uh, I thought that would add more inventory. <laughs> I really did. Ah, uh, that's okay though. That's a uh, that's an improvement right there. So now if we get these bottle rockets out, let me tell you, fun stuff can now happen. Let me do that real quick. <laughs> Alright. Uh, put them in on our hot bar. This is full, right? Yep. Let's go ahead and kill that guy. Pretty sure that's it for this. Oh, right, there's a dragon head on the front. Um, I don't want to drop this on the ground. So let's just do this right here. And we're going to take that with us too, because of course we want to take the dragon head. Alright, we don't need any blocks. <laughs> so. Now that we've got this, right, you see how that worked? So, <laughs> I'm going to take a leap of faith here. And we can fly. There we go. Don't you look at that. We have uh, 
Feather Falling too, so we don't get too hurt by any of that. Now, I've got everything I want, I think. Um, oh, maybe you make the shulkers like this? Heck if I know. Alright, I'll look it up. How do we get back? <laughs> All right, and that's the that's the next thing. Let's uh Does anyone know? I built a bridge, right? Where was that bridge at? We've got a limited amount of bottle rockets here too, by the way, so we don't want to waste them. I'm officially lost. There it is. Okay, so there's the bridge. Our home should be... Our destination home should be somewhere through here. These do take damage, but they'll, uh, they'll repair themselves with XP if we wear them and uh, get XP. Ah, there's my home. Can we fly into this? Yes, we can. Alright, there we go. That's how you do it. So uh, I'm going to go back to the base now and we can look over our loot. Alright, so from looting one end city, we, uh, we got all of this, which is uh, fairly impressive if you ask me. Um, I mean, some of the stuff is just really good, like the, uh, wh which one was it? One of these chest plates. Yeah, protection for mending, and, you know, six diamonds. All of this is just really good stuff. Um, what I'm really excited to do <laughs> is to take this, and I know, yeah, I got more gunpowder. What we're going to do real quick is we're going <laughs> to... We're gonna grab some rockets and we're gonna fly around. <laughs> we haven't been able to fly around our world, you know. This is a it's a new experience for me. Just saying. Okay, so we need 26, 27, right? So let's go down. We're gonna get a fly around view of our world, and uh, we can go tornado chasing with these mending wings, or yeah, with these elytra wings, which I will definitely do. So let's just like this. That's how you do it. And we have all the rockets in the world and nothing holding us back now. <laughs> so let's just turn that on half a day too. Let's just do a little world tour from the air, why don't we? Just because we can. <laughs> I'm uh, pretty excited about this. It's uh, some nice stuff. Oh. Here we go. So, there's our windmill. See our nice little tower. Can we fly through here? Oh, no, but we can land there. And this tower is a nice way to take off, too. As you can see, our uh, airport tower that we built here. Nice, nice. And of course, there's our nice, beautiful house. At the river that runs by it. Very cool, very cool. Let's, uh, let's see our village here. That we, uh, we uh, protected and rebuilt here. Looks nice, looks nice. And of course over here we've got the next one that we're going to do. It's, uh, it's just getting started, but it's, it's going to be a smaller one. And uh, need some more lights, but you uh, you can see what the potential is there. All right, let's just fly back to our house now. Ah, there it is, all coming into the render here. Notice there aren't any clouds in the sky, which is kind of concerning. But hey, who cares? Who cares? <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's just head back to the other base here. It kind of defeats the purpose of the railway, doesn't it? Let's look at our sugarcane farm from above. Oh yeah, that's nice, isn't it? This place here is a mess. 
Look at where I messed up the settings. The absolute destruction to the land here. Man, that's so bad. We can see our uh, other village that we took the villagers from right up here. Nice, nice. And uh, that's pretty much it in this world. But man, is it fun to be able to do this right here. To just fly around. And you know, I never tore this thing down because I never... Oh, wow. Some leaves. Oh, man. <laughs> I never, uh, never wanted to build up here. But I think now that I'm up here, I'm going to tear it down. I'm, uh, I'm going to need some practice with the flying, by the way, but don't worry, I'll get the hang of it. Um, I think, yeah, I'm going to tear this down now that I can uh, get up here. And this will be an improved, improved thing in our world. <laughs> but, uh, oh, is it nighttime? Interesting. Is it actually nighttime? It's hard to tell. But yeah, I'm going to tear this down, and then we're going to see if we can get a tornado to spawn so that we can chase it with these wings. So be right back. Alright guys, we do have a storm that spawned in. Unfortunately, it's heading way into the ocean, but I'm literally just going to chase anything at this point. So, uh, let's head on up here and just go after this thing. Like I said, I just want to see what chasing is like. Now that we, uh, can do this and let's see if I can start to perfect this takeoff damn it <laughs> it's not that easy to do apparently all it does at that time all right there we go let's just head off and see this thing like I said I'm not oh I didn't even take the radar I don't even care I don't need it <laughs> oh cool I didn't even realize there was a water temple right here That'll be on the to-do list, won't it? Yeah, look at that. How did I not see that? There's a cow. <laughs> Let's just dive in and look at this thing real quick. Isn't that cool? Apparently I can take off out of the water just like that. <laughs> Alright, let's see if this thing turns into uh turns into a uh, tornado or not it's going to be a hurricane still it's pretty cool my question is how do the physics work here am i being picked up right now I'm definitely flying I don't know. I don't know how the physics work. Uh, am I gaining latitude? Eh, yeah, I am. So it does pick you up. That's kind of depressing. I wanted it to be a tornado. Yeah, see, it's still affecting me. But I'm pretty sure I can fly out at any point if I need to. Alright, where's my home? Home is this way. Alright, we're not chasing a hurricane. <laughs> But well, that is going to wrap up today's episode. Hope you all enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe if you did. Um, next episode, we will probably finish up that village repair. And we will, you know, switch some villagers out. Um, hello, Water Temple. <laughs> that I didn't even realize existed. I think I might have seen it once before, but we will definitely have to visit this thing and uh, raid that. It's actually really close to the shore. It's kind of cool. Um, but yeah, um, some exciting things are happening here. I can fly now, and we got all those cool tools and uh, the expanded inventory. But yeah, I'm on the agenda. Oh man, that's uh, super close to the base. On the agenda will be uh, for us to, uh, like I said, finish finish up this village project. Um, I never showed you all the village, so I guess I'll do that now. Notice how much damage these wings take, um, so I need to do some XP farming. 
Some of these houses are a little wonky, okay? I'm not gonna lie to you. They're a little, a little wonky. But they'll, they're okay. Don't make fun of them or anything. Um, I did my best. <laughs> but the villages are all lit up. I repaired all the houses that I could with this wall going around. I want to add a couple more of these to some darker spots. Try and get rid of some of the torches. But other than that, it's it's exactly how I want it. So we'll finish up the village project. We'll probably fight that underwater temple and get all that we need out of it. Get some sponges, which would be pretty cool. And uh, also, we will probably make an Enderman farm in the end. And we'll, that'll be good for XP. Um, and other than that, I'm not sure what else I'll have planned. That'll be later on down the road, but I'm sure there's more stuff for us to do. There's always plenty. That's just some uh, short-term what you can expect out of this series. We'll probably expand on this villager thing. It's been a theme for me, and I really enjoy it. Oh, look, and they're trading back and forth, so I'll say, I'll say the, ugh, I'd expect them to breed if they're doing that. We'll see, though. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed, and let's just go ahead and trade for this cleric real quick while we... I was, uh, I was about to go trade because the storm wasn't spawning in, <laughs> so uh, I grabbed all the stuff to do that, and... Wow, you're not going to regenerate after all of that. Thank you. <laughs> That's all we wanted. Nothing special. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you all later. Bye.